Okay, well hello YouTube and this video today is going to demonstrate how you can add pictures into your eBay description uh, and kind of spice them up a little bit and maybe make them look a little bit better to your buyers. Um, it's actually a very easy process. I'm not going to go into a lot of detail, um, but I will focus on getting there quick. So to start off, I'm just going to do a normal, uh, Just I went to sell on my eBay. And then I, I have a normal, just a UPC, it's of a video game that I have. I'm not actually going to sell it, but it's just for demonstration purposes. Um, I'm just going to click on that. And it loads all the information, the product information and everything. It's just pretty much how you would normally see it. So we scroll down here, here's the description. And this is just the normal description uh, box, pretty much just like a text box. You know, we can type this. This item is in very good condition. So that's pretty much for the most part what you would probably see on um, most eBay descriptions for most items. Uh, now on some of the uh, more fancy ones, they add pictures, they add uh, different templates and stuff. And for the sake of this video, we're just going to focus um, on pictures and how to add pictures. I know that for a while, um, eBay made it so that you could only upload one picture without uh, for free and then you had to pay for more pictures I think that they've increased that to a few more um, but if you actually want to add them to your description to or have run out of pictures that you can add through eBay's free process this will show you how to do that um, and so essentially what we're gonna do now is um, I'm gonna show you um, basically a a picture hosting service that's free um, and what what I use is it's called photo bucket you might have heard it before um, and essentially what it is is they they allow you to upload any picture uh, you want to on your account so I created my own account and you can do that simply very easily and create an account and upload your pictures um, and so after you've uploaded your pictures you can click on them and they make it extremely easy if you scroll down here now this, I know that this picture has absolutely nothing to do with um, the game that's sell, that's, that I'm selling. I'm not actually going to list this, but it's just to show you guys. And over here you'll see that it says HTML code. Um, now we're not going to get all caught up in the technical terms of that. Um, basically HTML is the language that a browser reads. Um, but for the sake of time, I'm not going to get into that. And if you click on it, it automatically copies that code, which is pretty convenient. You're going to get the, go back over here, and instead of putting it in standard, which if you did, it would just kind of look like nothing and nothing would change. If you go to HTML on this little tab, and you copy it in here, voila, there you go. There's that picture that is actually being hosted on PhotoBucket that is now appearing in our little text box. So it's incredibly easy and completely free. So I can go to the next picture, do the exact same thing, make sure I'm in HTML, and we'll do even one more. If I copy that one in there, I'm just doing Control C and Control V, actually Command V, because I'm on a Mac. So then you go back to standard, and there are your three pictures. Now I know that they are pretty big, um, and that's because my camera took them, or my camera takes pretty uh, big pictures, but you can actually um, decrease the size, um, and basically that's just some HTML modifying, which you can easily do. Um, if you don't know how to do it, you can easily Google search how to make an image smaller HTML, you know? Um, and they will kind of, there's plenty of tutorials and stuff. I'm not going to get into it just because we're going to focus on how to get pictures in. So that's really those three pictures right there. And I'll prove to you that they will actually work and will not change the price. If you scroll down, it's five cents. That's just because I have it on a buy it now. Let's see, I'll scroll back up here. I'll make it an online auction. And if I do that, I just started at 99 cents. Need to make sure it's conditioned. We'll say it's very good because I said that in the description. We click continue, and there's see it's zero dollars and zero cents in fees, so it does not charge you one bit. And then if I scroll down here and go to preview your listing, what you'll see is there it is the game Battle Stations Midway, 
And there, look at that. The item is in very good condition. Of course, you'll probably add a little bit more, and there are your pictures. Looks very official um, and gives a lot more detail. So, and it looks like I'm on reserve battery power. So, but that has nothing to do with anything. So, but yeah, so that's just a quick uh, video on how to add pictures to your descriptions. I hope that's helpful, and I really hope that you, you know, like, comment, and subscribe. So, thanks, guys.